hey guys welcome back to our youtube channel thank you for coming to click on this video welcome to love and friends fam we're happy to have you all back to this vlog once again guys so we're heading out i and olga we're heading out we're going out for dinner this has been long overdue we've been so busy i've been busy he's been busy and finally today we said okay let's go and do this because it's already paid for whether you come and eat or you don't come and eat your money will go we decided okay come we need to like do everything possible to go and make use of this um of this thing that i've already paid for it wasn't by uh you know by choice that we've not gone out others wise just that you know activities family work and stuff like that so here we go now um heading for this dinner day then hoping that you know the food will be good so we're gonna carry you guys along so that you get to the, you know see what the place looks like or see what we're gonna be eating i don't know what i what i will be filming but you know anyways you guys hang in there and enjoy the rest of those vlog Hey, so guys, how many of you remember this road? Do you remember a video that I posted one time where I talked about things I don't like about Italian? This was actually the road I was, <laughs> I was at that very day when I made that, that video. It's curvy, it's dangerous, and it's, you know, it's even worse to drive on this road at night. But since it was Ogata was driving, he's familiar, very, very much familiar with this road. So there's nothing to fear. And there are no street lights, unfortunately. I don't even know why they don't have street lights here. Anyway, shall let's continue. So we've arrived at the restaurant. It's called Vecchio Masso. It's located at Sopramonte uh, in Trento. For those that you know are familiar with uh, Trento, you might have heard of this particular place. The restaurant is okay. It's fine. It's actually a hotel with restaurants. You know what I mean? and it's a cool place it's beautiful it's old and it's beautiful so we actually appreciated what we saw when we came in and the the girl this lady here is, is the one that um that works as a receptionist so she gave us a, a warm welcome after which she you know showed us what we'll be having for dinner basically and then gave us our welcome drinks so here we are with our glasses of champagne, you know, just chilling and just chatting here, waiting to like, you know, be escorted down to the restaurant itself because the restaurant is actually on the ground. So here we are walking down to the main um, restaurant, like should I call it the main restaurant or should I call it the main room? When we came in, we noticed the whole place was sort of empty. <laughs> We were basically, um, you know, say the the fifth or sixth people inside the restaurant. Obviously, I didn't want to like, um, you know, put the people in my video in order not to, you know, uh, disturb their privacy. You know what I mean? So the the waiter actually served as well. He was welcoming. He was nice, and he showed us to our seats. Obviously, and brought us water and brought us. Uh, you know wine as well so we're just relaxing and gossiping obviously we're gossiping that ah, this place is so empty why is it so empty <laughs> it's true that we actually arrived early because we booked for seven o'clock in the evening which is 19 o'clock so let's say we arrived too early so but because of the kids obviously we can't you know um go so late and in Italy they don't spend so much uh, so much time open you know during this covid period so well this is um the what is it called is it appetizer yeah this is appetizer and it was yummy it wasn't bad we actually enjoyed it well guys you just enjoy the rest of this our chopping chopping <laughs> i know some people will say you boy just enjoy you are not giving us anything my ladies is once in a while they you know we've been busy eh? we deserve this pampering what should i say now we deserve it jerry please feed your eyes <laughs>
Hey guys, so we're done at this restaurant. What do I think? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Amor, what do you think of this restaurant? I don't know if I've seen it so much. Pieno, follato, romantico. Thank you, Amor. Oh my god! <laughs> Guys, it was a terrible, terrible experience, I swear to God. Okay, okay, not terrible, but that was not a dieci. How much was that? Five minutes. Five minutes? I don't have five minutes. I don't have five minutes. <laughs> no, oh my God! So I asked him between one and one to ten. He said five and a half. Honestly speaking, I wouldn't even give them a five. Uh, the place where we arrived was empty. It was as if we came to a post, uh, a place where we were to just dine with just ghosts. Then after a while, few people started arriving and all. The meal, the first, um, the first course wasn't bad. It was okay. The pasta ravioli that they brought, the ravioli wasn't bad as well. But the third one, ah, 
that was terrible i i didn't like it one bit the fish they brought for me the fish wasn't good at all i didn't like it it tasted old the potatoes was they were old the potatoes were old and they the the yogurt sauce was but the test was horrible i didn't enjoy that Herbison wasn't so bad but it wasn't the best as well so from one to ten i will give it a four and a half quattro e mezza mi specificato che mi ha portato tutto in questo posto è giusto che sappiano Herbie said did i specify that i actually brought him to this place Guys, it wasn't my fault. I saw it on, uh, I saw it in this uh, website, and you know the the review said it wasn't bad, it was okay. I so that that was why I booked for it. But honestly speaking, I will not come here again. I will not spend my time in a place like this again. I will not recommend it to even anybody. It's, it's a no no for me. It's a no no. This place wasn't good. I'm not satisfied. Not so not satisfied. That they refer, eh? Not so not satisfied. But uh, let me just say the only thing enjoyable about this outing is the fact that I hanged out with hobby. We just had moments to ourselves, you know, to just um, just talk and you know be away from the kids for just a couple of hours. That was the best part of you know these outings so thank you so much for watching guys we really do appreciate each and every one of you do not forget that you all are loved and appreciated see you in the next one